So you may remember, the last video, I showed you guys this. 65% of you that were watching my videos weren't subscribed. So, uh, after I said that, we actually got close to 1800 subs in a day, which is my new record. But still, only 43.8% of you that watched the video were subscribed. So if you don't want to miss out on any of my epic content, you can subscribe, or you can turn on notifications so you don't miss it. But yeah, it's really up to you. Uh, enjoy the rest of the video. It's going to start now. Do you hate being poor? Do you want to be rich like me? Well, go over to Messy Modding Services, where you can buy GTA 5 modded accounts, GTA 5 money, and rank for PS4, Xbox One, and PC. Check their website out in the link below. And if you're having doubts, just look at all these happy customers. So the story starts with me just you know, loading into a GTA Online session. I do what I usually do, which is spawn in, check the playlist, see any interesting accounts. Now see at the bottom of the playlist, we've got ele Electric Silence, he spelled electric wrong, with a negative 233,000 KD. So I thought this is this would be quite interesting. Let's um let's start a fight with him. He also looked like he was dressed kind of like a tryhard. Somewhat, I don't know, bulletproof helmet, face paint, stuff like that. So I thought maybe I could get like an, a fight with someone that actually knows how to play the game. So we'll get a pretty easy kill in here and then just fly away because I thought this guy looks like a tryhard, he's probably going to chase me down, so we, we just see what happens, so I just, just fly away. Sure enough, you can kind of see on the map, he's driving over towards me. Not super close because he knows that I can lock on, but I'm guessing he kind of wants his kill back. So I just lock onto him again. Now, when I fire a rocket at him, you'll see. He actually blows himself up. This is kind of a tryhard tactic. So I'll let you guys choose for yourself whether you think this guy's a tryhard or not. But anyway, he keeps on doing this. So here I actually managed to kill him somehow. I must have shot just at the right time where it blows up his sticky bomb, which blows him up as well. But as you can see his little blip on the minimap, it just disappears. And eventually I find out that he goes ghost. I thought it was maybe an RC tank or something, but he straight went ghost. And I could hear a jet, so I'll go on top of a rooftop. I'll start trying to snipe him. That's on PS4, so. It's quite a bit hard to snipe one out of chat, especially when you're not used to it.
So here I'm noticed that uh, I can't call a mug on him, which usually means that they're in passive or in a facility. Or like in, in an apartment or something. So I get this message, you're too easy. One for one beach base RNG, you know, typical desperate tryhard message. And you can kind of see in the minimap, he's actually in a facility. So my theory is right. Now I have one minute and 25 seconds left for me to hide so that he can't hold can of me. <laughs> It's coming at you. Yeah, well, this guy didn't actually accept the 1v1 in the end. He just sent me messages and it's like he didn't even see what I sent. Uh, but yeah. I hope, I hope you found that fight somewhat interesting. Drop a like if you did. Comment down below what you thought of the video. I don't know. The usual stuff. But yeah, thanks for watching.